Essentially, Fei Long traded Aaron and uh, James for Sharia and myself, and uh, I don't know how they feel about that trade. Uh, hopefully they don't mind it too much and they don't just shoot me off right away, but uh, only time's going to tell. We still have to figure out how things are going to work here. I'm just trying to make sure I'm not the first one off. I had made a joke to Shreya earlier that it'd be hilarious if we saw James and Aaron floating by the other way, just as, you know, befuddled as we were in this situation, and then we did, and there was James spelling some nonsense, yelling, and Aaron throwing his little smile, and it was just basically both of us knowing that we were both going in, both of our groups were going into tough positions. Aaron and James were going into a tough spot at Jean Hu, and Shri and I are going to a tough spot at Fei Long. But all of us are warriors. We're going to do our best to fight it out and make our way. And that's what this game is about, because in the end, it's just a battle to get to the finish. It's pretty interesting, and I, I love that about this game. You get to meet new people, and you've got to find a way to work with anyone. So. It's been pretty cool, and I think this whole experience is pretty amazing, just being stuck in an even stranger position than the original one I was in, and still trying to find my way, just overcome any of the obstacles that stand before me. From the moment I stepped on Fei Long's beach, I was trying to figure everyone out, figure out where my place would be in this tribe, the same way I did the second I stepped on the Jean Hu beach. So Todd seemed to be essentially what everyone thought. He's a survivor geek, he loves it, he knows what's going on, he can pretty much predict the the next challenges or or switches like the weather. Like he just knows it, and uh, he's really fun, real smart, and someone I I could see myself really getting along with, which is kind of what I expected. Courtney is also similar to things I've heard. You know, she makes her jokes, she rolls her eyes, but she's sweet on the inside and really nice. Um, Denise is a little bit, she's, she's up front about everything and she's a lot nicer to me than I would have thought, but really hard on like Jean Robert. So that was interesting, but from what, I, what I've heard uh, from other people in the tribe, she doesn't mess around with strategy or gameplay, just plays it straight up, wants to win, wants to build her kids a park. I don't know. But she's really nice, really cool. Amanda, same as I would have expected, just quiet, nice. Uh, but I've been getting along with her really well because she's so open and we both were, have uh, lived in Chicago and she's got a really interesting past and so we've been getting along pretty well. And Jean Robert is essentially like Fei Long's Dave. He's out there trying to lead, talking himself up. If my new tribe sees me as helpful around camp and possibly helpful in the next few challenges, maybe they'll keep me around longer. If they're thinking about a possible merge, Maybe they're thinking about getting rid of me sooner because they see me as a threat. Either way, there's a reason that they brought both of us over here. It's because they saw something else that they thought would help them, and I'm hoping that we can help them, unless they just wanted to vote us off anyway, and that's their plan all along, which suck. <laughs> Straight up, there's nothing to it that would suck. I consider the possibility that Fei Long might pull me. I mean, it's really easy to see why they pick Sharia. The girls all see that she's like the strongest girl. She's the biggest. She also worked our puzzles, so they know she's smart. Um, me, I guess that they, they saw that I was athletic from a few of the challenges. Uh, the first one when I raced James, James, I guess, made a big fuss about it. And uh, also I picked up the slack when Dave fell in the battering ram challenge. and knocked out the wood challenge so they saw I was athletic and I think that they just couldn't tell who it was going to be like me or Eric so I guess they chose me which I suppose is some sort of compliment not really what I would have liked but mm. there's a lot of pressure to fill the role of the strongest worker and their fearless leader and uh, it's it's interesting how they're reacting because some people seem to feel like Maybe it's better off without the tension that was there. Some people are wanting to step up to leadership, I'm sure. Things are really changing here at Fei Long, and uh, it's not what anyone would have expected. It's not what I expected, and um, I just want to make it through the day. I think I had a pretty good idea of how things were going to be, and it's all sort of fitting in. Now I just have to figure out how I'm going to fit in.